again hello everyone how are you guys if you're watching this on sunday when it goes up i hope you're having a great sunday if you're watching it some other time i just hope you're having a great day before i like get into you know this vlog i feel like i should just kind of like say something about everything that's been going on in the world um i really like to keep my videos and my channel a happy place and just like a place that we could be like lighthearted and fun and just have a good time together for, like my own memory's sake but i do just want to say that i feel like the state of the world right now it kind of like honestly it breaks my heart because there's so much negativity and so many awful and hurtful things that are going on and i just hope that you know whatever you are whoever you are i just hope that you are staying safe and you are doing well you're doing okay and i just hope that you know my heart and my prayers go out to you every single one of you that is watching this video i just want you to know that my heart is with you my prayers are with you and we're gonna get through this that's my little spiel i just felt like i had to like say something before i could like get into you know this vlog so today it is Friday. It is a very chill day, but I feel like I have a lot of things to like show you guys and like this you guys on. First of all, um, just because I'm staring right at it, I got a new computer case. It's pink. I love it. It just came in the mail. I ordered it back in like the beginning of May. It is now June 5th and I got it off of Amazon and I have Prime. So that was kind of weird, but anyway, this is like not like bright enough for me there we go that's a fun update um my hair i got it like touched up again and i absolutely love it now it's like exactly where i want it to be it's super nice and well blended and when i pull it up into a ponytail the like heavy heavy streaks are kind of gone now so it kind of just like all blends together which is super fun and i love that i absolutely love how it looks now my skin has been doing pretty well i broke out kind of like badly the last couple weeks just i think from stress and stuff like that but clearing up a little bit more i've been trying not to wear so much makeup the last like week Ish. so we're going all natural again today i'm trying to just like give my skin a chance to breathe I have a new coffee recipe that i'm going to show you guys later on in this vlog and some packages and unboxings to show you guys even though we're chilling at home it's still going to be a fun day i also have a super exciting project that is in the works i'm not going to say too much about it because I don't want to spoil it. Just wanted to give you guys a little hit. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I hate when people do this. I hate when YouTubers do this, but I just want to let you guys know that there is a super exciting project coming pretty soon, and I'm excited for it, and I hope that you guys are going to be excited for it. So comment down below what you think it is or what you hope it is, because you might be right. Anyway, <laughs> it's 11.30 a.m. I just got back from a workout. I got a shake and stuff like that. Yeah, I'm going to chill at home for a little bit. I've been watching Outer Banks, you guys. I started that show on netflix it is so good it's so not the type of show that i typically watch like you guys know me i am so like the anna montana katie keen gossip girl one tree hill kind of girl like i love those kinds of shows but i don't know everyone has been watching outer banks and all my friends told me that i needed to watch it and literally every single one of my friends has seen it but me so i was like okay you know what like fine i'll watch it i'm not even kidding i've been binging it so hard i have two episodes left so i actually think i'm gonna watch one of them now before i eat lunch i've been on my health grind you guys I've been working out so much. I've been really really focused on my diet a lot and the things that I've been eating and stuff Okay, I'm gonna shut up now. I'm so glad that we got to do that little catch-up real quick I'm gonna watch some Outer Banks <laughs> I feel like I should show you guys my out of the day now because if not I'm going to forget so I have my purple Lululemon sports bra with this little white cropped t-shirt I think from Princess Polly. I wear this all the time. I love it My Lululemon leggings and then my slides which I was so upset because the other day I was sitting at my kitchen table and my brother's like why does your shoe have a crack in it and i was like what are you talking about look i was so upset that i didn't even notice this this crack literally like what i don't know how that happened or when it happened but it did very upset about it so i guess i need new slides now but i'm so upset because these are my favorite slides you guys know i literally wear them in every single vlog and it made me so upset when i saw that but Anyway, I think that I need to order my Fabletics stuff because it is the fifth already and they had some stuff that I wanted So let me actually do that really quick. Alright guys, so I just purchased my Fabletics for the month I got this. It's called the Tanks A Lot three-piece outfit, which it's just three cropped tank tops that I think are so cute. There's one that's pink and that's like a blue yellowish watercolor kind of thing and then a white one. They're so cute. Let me see if I can show you guys. I got this. I don't know how well you guys can see that but it's called the Tanks A Lot three-piece outfit and then it's like this pink crop top and then this like 
bluish white like watercolor kind of one and then i love that that's so cute then just like the plain white one just because i feel like i can never have too many cropping tops for working out in and stuff super super excited about those excited to get those in the mail sorry if you can hear my dogs they just make a cameo every single vlog what can i say i'm gonna watch an episode of outer banks and then i'll see you guys for lunch oh my god you guys i just finished watching outer banks and first of all i literally cried in the last episode um, i'm not gonna spoil it in case any of you guys are watching but i literally cried halfway into it and then that ending i'm like i need the next season right now <laughs> right now it's 1 34 p.m i'm waiting for my mom and my sister to get home because they're picking up some chick-fil-a for lunch so i'm gonna have that i think i got a grilled chicken sandwich and some fruit so i'm gonna have that and then i'm gonna make my coffee after and i'm gonna show you guys a new way that i've been making my coffee because it's been really good i completely forgot i totally meant to show this in a vlog but i haven't like vlogged until today but i actually got these two letters from these little girls and if you're watching this these He's literally made my day. There were just these two little letters that are so cute. Like, this one has like my name, so but then like we're just put in it and Top Gun, and this one's got like so Top Gun 005. They're so cute. Um, the girls' names are Camille and Brooklyn. This one, I don't know if they would want me to read them like on camera or if it was just meant for me, but they were basically just saying that they're huge fans, love my YouTube videos and TikToks. Thank you guys so, so much. These literally made my day when I got them. I was like, who sent me mail? And then I opened it and I was like, oh my God, literally the most adorable things in the world. So thank you guys so, so much. This made my absolute entire day. It literally put the biggest smile on my face. I just had to share that with you guys because it melted my heart. <laughs> now it's time to make some TikToks. The other day, I literally spent like two hours just on TikTok learning a bunch of TikToks, but I didn't post any of them. I was just like learning the dances. And now that I know them, I'm gonna post them. So that's what we're gonna do. So if you're not following me on TikTok, you should because I post on it a lot, especially right now because I have nothing else to do. And I want to do that. All right, let's do it. Okay, that wasn't bad, but I feel like I could do better. <laughs> All right guys, that's enough TikToks for now. I made a few, but I heard my mom get home, so I'm gonna go eat some Chick-fil-A now. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. All right, you guys, it is now coffee time. I finished my lunch, it was so good. It is 2.38 p.m., so we're gonna make our coffee. Now, I've been making the stovetop coffee because I finally got an electric coffee bean grinder, and we have the coffee beans from Carmella that we have been grinding in the coffee maker, and it's been really, really good. I'm gonna show you guys how I do it. Oh my God, and I don't think I've showed you guys this yet, but this is my new coffee cup. My sister's friend's mom made it. Look at how pretty that is. It's like fully bedazzled. It says Sophia's coffee on it. I don't know if that's gonna focus for you see that. It's a Sophia's coffee that's got a crown on it and like a hot pink. It's basically like a Starbucks cup, but it was a Starbucks cup turned fabulous. <laughs> so first things first, I take the cup and I'm just gonna fill it with water, the exact amount that I would normally have filled with coffee. Like normally my milk, I fill up to like, with like the two ice and everything, the milk will fill up to the second line. So pretty much the rest of it, which is about half, should be filled with water. So I'm gonna fill the cup to the second line with water. Water is in the cup and now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take that water and dump it into the bottom bottom part of my little stove top coffee here. And the reason why I pour the water into the cup first and not directly into here is because this way I can measure the exact amount of water that I need. We're gonna take our coffee beans and we're gonna pour them into the grinder. This is our coffee bean grinder. Basically, this just comes up right here. You can see there's like leftover coffee grinds in there. But I'm gonna take the coffee beans and I'm just gonna fill it to cover all of this silver area. Now we're gonna take the lid. Put it right back on here and then this just like kind of pulses like that i'm gonna hold on to it and i'm just gonna grind the coffee beans that should be good so now i'm gonna take my coffee spoon which is my favorite spoon in the world which lucy if you're watching this my friend lucy got me this spoon for christmas if you look really closely it says coffee makes me poop <laughs> I love it. All right, and now I'm gonna take this little like gasket thing that goes inside the coffee thing. If you like make stovetop coffee all the time, you're probably watching this and you're like, uh, this is common knowledge, but I didn't know for a while. So just in case you don't know how to do it, this is, I'm teaching you. <laughs> We're gonna basically scoop the coffee grounds out of here onto the spoon, put them into the gasket, just enough to um, fill it for the amount of coffee that I want. So now that I'm done with that, I'm gonna put the gasket into here, just like that. And we're gonna screw this 
onto here. So I'm gonna do this off camera because I need both hands. Alrighty, now we're gonna take this guy, put him over here, open that, and turn on the stove. Yeah. Okay, so now I've got my coffee and then my cup, and now is the fun part where we just put everything together. So let me grab the caramel, and we're pretty much just gonna fill it a teeny tiny bit with the caramel, maybe like two capfuls. I'm gonna do one, two, three, four. I'm gonna mix that together, and we're gonna add the milk to about the like one and a half line. We're gonna mix our milk and our caramel together now. Is this ASMR? And we're gonna add in four more ice cubes. Two, three, four. Mix that. Now the fun part, pour the coffee in. I'm gonna show it to you guys this way because you're not gonna be able to see it through the rhinestones on the cup. Oh, that is beautiful. That really is nice. I pour the coffee directly over the ice so that it kinda like chills it to make the iced coffee like to make it colder faster if that makes sense and now we mix it mix it all together now for the moment of truth cheers oh my god that's so nice this cup is from my sister's friend's mom and she is absolutely amazing she did it for me for my graduation if you guys want to check it out or you going to get a cup similar to mine go to i'll have her etsy shop i'll put it up on the screen i want to say it's bling bling and more bling like the letter n then more bling yeah she's amazing this cup is my new favorite thing of life so you should definitely check it out i love it it makes my coffee an event <laughs> i'm gonna clean up my area and stuff and then probably go oh i have to show you guys packages so okay we'll do that All right so i just set you guys up on my desk really quick while i show you guys these super cute shoes i'm so excited first of all huge shout out to this brand alexandria brandale they sent me these two pairs of shoes i haven't even opened the box yet because i've been waiting to do it on camera packaging is so cute it just has like let's couture by alexandria brandale i think is what it says and on the bottom under here it just says be you be kind be love xoxo and alexandria brandeo and it has like their instagram and stuff there i'm gonna just go ahead and open it i'm gonna get scissors so i can go ahead and open it <laughs> okay i think we've just got one nice large box here that's so cute okay so on the outside the little bag had like the red writing took out the box it's got the same thing but in pink which is so cute you guys know my favorite color in the world is pink and it's like kind of holographic and stuff which i love okay hold on i'm gonna move my little setup for a second so you guys can appreciate this right, so this is the box that we're working with i opened it here and looked it up and then it says you be kind be love so so cute and then over here we just open this Oh my god. This is so cute. Oh my god, they come in these little like Ziploc bags. That's adorable. Okay, so I just took out like the um, billing and shipping information. But this is what it has. It's got this little card that says, Be you, be kind, be love. It starts with you. One little act of kindness at a time can fill the world with absolute love. I love that. That is so cute. Okay, and then it just has like care instructions and stuff. Love that. And then there's this little handwritten note, which is so, so cute. So it all starts with you. Same little saying, I guess. And then it says, Hi, Sophia. Hope you love your AB shoes. We can't wait to see how you style them feel free to tag us which i definitely will oh my god this is so cute okay and now we've got the shoes okay so i got two different pairs of shoes they're both like sandal kind of thing so the first one is one i love that it comes in these little like ziploc bags i think that's so cute it has like the same saying on the bag zip it Oh my god, I love these. Get these out. I love that it's like a little dust bag. That's super cute. Okay, and then we're gonna unwrap these. Ah! Oh my god. Stop. This is so cute. They're like these jelly shoes. Stop. These are adorable. Okay, so these are the shoes. One of the pairs of shoes that I got. These are called the Aria Neon Pink, which I believe they also have the kid sizes of these. But these are so cute. They're these neon pink little sandal, and it's got like studs kind of going across it. And then it just like has this backdrop, which I love. They're so, <laughs> so cute. And I love the neon pink. I'm definitely going to be wearing these all throughout the summer. Oh my god. Other shoes. I'm so excited for these i believe these are the aurora in the shade and nude oh my god these are so cute oh my god these are so cute 
It's the same material as the other ones. They're like these jelly um, sandals. And these also have the studs, but instead of like the same color as the shoe, these ones are kind of like this gold color. These are so pretty. I love these. So cute. I'm living my best right now. I feel like I should try like one on on each foot. So yeah, let's do that. Hey guys, so I just put one of each sandal on and I am obsessed with these. I have never worn any type of like sandals or shoes from this company before and I'm literally giving my complete and total honest opinion. They're super comfy and I'm normally not the biggest fan of like the jelly type of shoes but I absolutely love these. They're so so comfortable. I feel like I could walk around in these all day long and be super comfy. I These are so comfortable you guys like I'm not even kidding. I love all the straps, the detailing. I love the pink one. Once again definitely go check out those shoes. I'm not kidding. I have never owned a pair of shoes from them before but a lot of my friends do. I never tried their shoes before and I just try them and they're literally so amazing all my friends love them as well once again biggest biggest thank you in the world to Alexandria Brandeo for sending them to me so if you guys actually want to twin with me and get a pair for your own you can they gave me a discount code for free shipping for you guys if you're interested in buying them code is just SB free so I'll have that like floating on the screen right here SB free if you use that code at checkout then you can get free shipping if you want to buy some shoes I'm not even kidding I'm obsessed with them and if you get them you should definitely take a photo in them and tag me in it so that I know we're twinning and I will totally twin with you back and we'll have a whole party about it okay <laughs> one thing that I will say about the shoes is that I am typically a five and a half like a true true five and a half in all shoes something that I didn't I did notice on their size that they don't have half sizes but I sized down and got a five and that fit me perfectly like as if it was a five and a half so maybe if you're like in between sizes i would recommend to size down like if you're a six and a half or a seven and a half i'd recommend going six and a half to a six or if you're a seven and a half to a seven but other than that they're literally amazing i love them so much okay i've raved enough about them get a pair <laughs> okay time to make more tiktoks guys if you do not follow me on tiktok you really should thank you take things really sensitively i went That's all out for funny. this if you go to my tiktok and you watch this specific tiktok because of this vlog after you like see it comment on the tiktok red car emoji just comment like a red car if the vlog sends you because i'm very curious to see thank if you like we'll follow my tiktok from my vlogs okay so red car go comment okay we're posting what is up guys i'm now getting a snack i'm gonna have my yogurt and granola as you know if you've been like watching my vlogs loving this dairy-free yogurt super fun and then i'm gonna grab my granola bar to mash up and put in the yogurt i'm gonna eat this now and then get ready to work private hello it is now 7:04 p.m i just finished working a couple of privates that i had today now i'm just waiting for dinner i think we're ordering from somewhere <laughs> and i'm probably just gonna have like a salad or something all right, you guys, it is now 9.55 p.m. And I ate dinner and I just chatted with my family for a bit. It was super fun. And now I'm just going to get ready to go to sleep. So I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed it. And I'll see you super soon in my next video. Bye!